Good morning. This is Bobby Dupre with the Bobby Dupre Show, presented to you each Thursday morning at 7 a.m. And, of course, it's uh, replayed on Sunday afternoon at 3 p.m. in its entirety. Mm -hmm. And, uh, of course, uh, many of you are watching it on your cable. Some are watching it on Rabbit Ears uh, in the local uh, community here. And uh, more and more of you are watching it on the Internet uh, by way, basically, of com computers. But then more and more people are watching it on their uh, iPhone and iPad. Sure. So, uh, there's really no reason not to watch the Bobby Dupre show. Call a friend, uh, call a relative, uh, call somebody that uh, you think might be interested in good news only for one solid hour. My sidekick here, Mr. Andrew Gittros. Good morning. And uh, we're in, what, our 12th year on the television portion of the program. And uh, we completed uh, 36 years on KSLO radio and 105. Uh, uh, point uh, three, uh, which has gone to Spanish, and uh, we didn't get our lesson in time to learn the Spanish language. So, uh, sorry, and I and I miss I miss the radio, and a lot of our friends miss it because they'd watch portion of it at home, and then, then listen to the rest on the way to the on work. the way to work. They would it, it was a habit they were in, and uh, maybe uh, who knows maybe. KSLO will be resurrected again into English and uh, some French, of course. Uh, we have a lot of good things to talk about uh, this morning, but first thing we got to do is talk about our good sponsors, mm -hmm. and uh, that I'll leave up to you. Mr. All right, Andrew. we'll start with the Medicine Shop Pharmacy right here on 1717 South Union Street. Go by the Medicine Shop. They've got all kind of great things if you suffer with diabetes, asthma, cardiovascular disease. They've got a whole host of things to help you out with with the, the tests, the medication, the machines that you may need for it. They've got the 15-minute 15, 15 prescription service guarantee, which says that if you don't get your prescription in 15 minutes, you get a $2 store credit to use just like cash. They've got discounts for groups, older adults and preschoolers. And don't forget about the fact they keep track of those records for you. You know, right now a lot of people are doing their taxes, and you need to go and grab your records to, to file with your insurance and file with your taxes. They keep track of all that for you. You can print that out off their computers. That's the medicine shop pharmacy here in Opelousas. One more. <coughs> all right, let's see if I can get my throat right. Uh, let's also go with, how about uh, Steamboat Warehouse? Get mama away from the smell of her own cooking. Go down to Steamboat Warehouse in Washington, Louisiana. Go see chef owner Jason Huguet, who's always doing wonderful things down there with great Louisiana seafood. You know, you get into the end of one season, beginning of the next season, you can get some of that shrimp, some of that crab, some of that crawfish, all right now. It's the perfect time of, of the year to get all those good things, all those great steaks uh, that they've got there as well. Big wine selection, adult drinks, you know, your Bloody Marys with the pickle zydeco in it. And uh, don't forget also to see Jason on uh, the What's Cooking show here on KDCG as well. And he was cooking pork tasso buco. And Jody, and why tasso don't we buco. get, why don't we well, get uh, we Piggly can, Wiggly while we we're talking about it? We can do that too. While we're talking about Joey Quibito, who's also on our, our What's Cooking show, uh, Piggly Wiggly can get you all your good groceries. I was there this weekend again, and again during the week, you get those Boston butt pork rolls for 99 cents a pound. You can also get those good stuffed ones. I got an eight pound stuff, stuffed Boston butt rolls that I cooked this weekend. You talk about come out good. Well, I, I say was, I cook. I was hungry. I brought it home. I didn't hear and, from and my wife cooked it. Okay, well, uh, you know. I had that and some okra and some tomatoes I got from there as well. They even got some of the good things. I saw some of those chick, uh, those turkey fryers, those electric turkey fryers from uh, Cajun Injector, as low as $59 at Piggly Wiggly. If you go by, that's like half price. Go by at Piggly Wiggly South, Piggly Wiggly North, or in Sim Sport, and they got all kind of good stuff, even the whole cut up fryers, buck 19 a pound. Uh, we were talking before we went on the air just a a couple of minutes ago, we were talking about Blaine Gilray and his new venture is mm -hmm. what I call it. Uh, he and uh, his daughter, uh, KK, and her fiance, who are gonna be married sometimes in the near future. I think I got a pre notice, you know how today is. What are the parties? The, you gotta... the, well, no, it's, it's just to be prepared for the party. <laughs> All keep, right. Keep it on the, on your, uh, in your calendar. Right. Okay. <laughs> well, uh, and then uh, I was introduced to uh, a friend of theirs, 
and uh, he has several years of experience in restaurant business, mm -hmm. in uh, the franchise type restaurant mm -hmm. business. A little different operation from the mom and pop. Now, the mom and pop that uh, Blaine and Paulette and the Gilroy family uh, have over at King's, you can't beat it. I mean, mm -hmm. it's, mm -hmm. it's uh, tried and tested and tested right. and tried many, many times. And it works along with the casino. And they're advertisers in our uh, mm -hmm. mid program. And uh, anyhow, Blaine and uh, the, the, the young group that uh, he's uh, sponsoring, I guess he is, maybe they have their own money, I'm not sure, but more than likely, Dad sure is involved. handling it. Yeah, he's involved. They, the name of the new uh, business is gonna be Brick and Spoon, and uh, yes, it will open, I think, at six in the morning till about noon. So it's more uh, of a coffee breakfast type? Yes, uh, and then lunch. Mm -hmm. and, then, and then lunch, uh, I guess, from 11 to 2. Uh, a morning ritual that's anything but routine. That's mm -hmm. their logo. And uh, they're going to be franchising this and have already got uh, maybe four uh, franchisees that are very interested and may have put down a down payment. They can't open. He can't actually fully sign anyone until he has that place open. And that place is going to be opening sometimes probably within the next 30 days. They're close to completion. But when you have to get all these regulations uh, accommodated, inspectors, and, inspectors and, and things that come up uh, that you hadn't expected. But they soon to open. And I just want to mention that because it's nice to see a, a father and daughter and, and upcoming family uh, working together on a project. And uh, Blaine's all excited. So good luck to you all. And uh, I want to thank uh, Big D. I thanked him for doing a little uh, beautiful not a little job, a beautiful job of detailing uh, Kelly's uh, SUV mm -hmm. uh, recently, her, her Chevy. And uh, well, <coughs> maybe it's a GMC. It's a, it's a GM, GM product. product. GM product. Okay. But anyhow, Big D does a tremendous job. If you haven't had a, a, a detail a uh, job done over at Big D's on South Union Street. You need to try him out. And uh, you're going to see the big man and the big smile. Mm -hmm. And that's, he wakes up with that. I passed there at seven, a little after seven this morning, and he was already there working on his first vehicle. Mm -hmm. And uh, he did uh, a, a little favor for me recently. So now I'm thanking you, Big D, for the favor you did for Bobby Dupre at all. Thank you. They've got the World of Wheels uh, car show over the Cajun Dome this weekend from the 12th through the 14th. You can get a family pack of four tickets if you text the word WOW, W-O-W for World of Wheels, to 64636. That's for this weekend. It's a family pack for four. And we've also got some Angola Rodeo tickets. Five family packs are going to be given out. So if you text COWBOY to that same number, 64636, it's for the Angola Rodeo on April the 21st. That's a Sunday. Great world well, famous doing rodeo. Them, they're doing them twice a year year now because they do so. them back in they're October so popular, too. So popular and then yeah. you can go and you can buy a lot of the uh, arts and crafts that these guys make. I went to someone's house one day and they had one of these huge uh, chopping blocks. You know they have like the table in the kitchen mm -hmm. with a nice chopping block. I said what'd you get that? So I got that in Angola Rudy. I bought that from the uh, inmates. Well you know those guys have a lot of time on their hands. They, they, it was very <laughs> detailed. It was very detailed. You could uh, tell he wasn't in a rush. I, 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 was, I mentioned to you all that Community Coffee was coming out with their single servings mm -hmm. uh, for the coring. Show that photo uh, Steve. Yes sir. Uh, for the Corinth. Correct. And uh, there you go. And by the way, before I, I forget this time, I forgot last time, uh, the two little uh, objects there or treats that were given to me by Sabrina, who is, Sabrina <laughs> is uh, Andrew's wife. Right. That was my little care package over at the retreat house. And uh, you she know what? She found you some more. I, I, she found me some more. And uh, I, haven't, I haven't eaten them yet, uh, Sabrina. They're so good. It's just one whoop. It's gone. You go through them. I go through them. But thanks, baby. And anyhow, Community Coffee, I told y'all it would probably have been around the 6th before they would ship it. Next thir Last Thursday, my, my package was there. And as Community Coffee goes, it's delicious. So if you are one that uses a single servant, you can now get your own uh, regional, uh, nationwide now, coffee, community there coffee in the one cup servings. The, the state coffee. Yep.
Now, who helped us so much with the cerebral palsy uh, even every, every year. year. You're uh, Sunday night, mm -hmm. they had some big country awards uh, given out, and uh, I, I think I had heard, I think we had maybe spoken about Hunter Hayes being uh, on the program. Right. And uh, let me tell you, he didn't win any awards, but he won the award for, for showmanship mm -hmm. and probably the longest on the program because he did a number by himself and then he played with Stevie Wonder. Can you imagine being on the same stage Little with that Stevie man? Stevie Wonder, who's and now a full grown man. Full grown man. <laughs> Stevie Wonder must be in his 50s you know, or 60s. Uh, yeah, or oh, he's in his 60s. Yeah. And, you know, that's almost unheard of. And here we are now, I guess he's about 20. Uh, he started out, uh, first time was either six or eight years old. Uh, I'm talking about mm -hmm. Hunter Hayes oh, being even on smaller, national, even national TV. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, probably one of our local stations had got him on. And uh, the boy is really, really doing well and was part of the closing act with Stevie Wonder. And they left, they let out Thousands, thousands, like Clay Bertrand would say, thousands of balloons. Uh -huh. You missed that. It was a pretty it, thing. Oh, it was beautiful. It was beautiful. Well, he, he's very, very talented. You and I both have known that for years. But what, what is neat is that, you know, his, his promotion and production company have to be convinced, too. They wouldn't be helping to promote him this much if they don't think he's got a huge upside. Then I've got a, something they, special to add to that. Uh -huh. Well. I want to I want to thank Larry Leger for uh, Hunter Hayes and his family, Mr. And Ms. Leo. Oh, because uh, he was the he first guy helped to help promote helped him locally. Helped promote him oh, and yeah. ha bought a bus, and they had two letters on it, H H, mm -hmm. and that didn't stand for L L. That's right. H H for Hunter Hayes. So, uh, thank you. And, and I called him and congratulated him. He said you would, you know, you think about well, I think about people helping people. You know, uh, people helping, and Larry has nothing, he, he's not, he didn't, he didn't try to mm -hmm. sign him, he could have signed him up if he'd wanted that, that. Mm -hmm. but he knew that he had great potentials, and you need to go to the big city. He went to Nashville, when he got to Nashville, you know who one of the first people that Hunter Hayes contacted? Who's that? Blair. Uh, Daily. Daily. No kidding. Can, uh, Who's a big songwriter for all ball, the big acts. And yeah. he's written songs, oh, yeah. co-written well, no, Number songs. ones for just about everybody yeah, but out there, for, but Hunter Hayes too. For now. Hunter Hayes now. Yeah. Uh, uh, one or more of the, of the songs on his new album, mm -hmm. Wanted. Uh, That's Blair. Blair and, and some other young man who I, talk, I call Tom to talk about something else. Tom Daly's Tom uh, Blair's Daly's father. father. Mm -hmm. And uh, I said, did you happen to watch it? He says, you know I'm watching it. Blair does work with him. So then Carrie Underwood will be playing at the Cajun Dome in a couple of weeks, and, and uh, Hunter's going to be the front band for Carrie, and we're going to give tickets away on, on the show as well. So y'all be watching for that, too. And I'm going to close it. We, we, we can't go on all day on this. Right. But what about Dick Clark Productions is who was the producer the, the of show the together. show that, that night. Mm -hmm. I thought <laughs> that's that's big time. Oh, but, yeah. And those things are so beautiful. Boy, I'm yeah, telling you. It's a good way to promote the industry. Yes, sir. Yes, well, sir. folks, we're going to have to take a one-minute break here on TV. We will see oh, you. We gave Hunter Hayes, what, seven or eight spot. minutes. You can't get that on national that's TV right. except on the Bobby Dupre show. We'll see along you all with Andrew. On the other side. Side of one.